Hi, my name is Kristen, and this is my story. My story has a messy beginning, a rocky middle, but now there is beauty by God's grace. My past was filled with doubts, fears, and lies, all which I believed. As much as I felt a tug at my heart to turn to Christ, I felt it was something that had to be earned. I became weighed down with burdens, searching for love my soul desperately needed. Fast forward, I moved to a new neighborhood. I have been blessed to meet new neighbors who became friends. Through them, I've discovered the truth, God's word. I started attending church with neighbors, a sister, and reading and studying the Bible together. And I was and am in complete awe. Today, I no longer walk in the past, but that is certainly not by my own strength, but through Jesus who strengthens me. My traumatic memories, whether those I caused or caused by others, they may try to creep in, but they don't, because God is always with me. I accepted Jesus as my Lord and Savior last fall. I am in awe of the joy, peace, and love that surrender has brought me. All my trust is in Jesus. I have hope, and he's not done writing my story yet. This is why I want to be baptized and make this public proclamation of Jesus' Lordship over my life and as an act in obedience. I have found infinite love and freedom through Jesus Christ. Good morning, my name is Rita. I'm one of Kristen's neighbors who's had the privilege of watching her this journey the last few months especially. We've had times of prayer, discussion together and it's been a beautiful thing. Behind me are more neighbors and a sister of her, Kristen's joining us today. Kristen, I have two questions for you. Do you believe in Jesus as your Lord and Savior? Yes. Do you intend to follow him all the days of your life? Yes, with all heart. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, I baptize you. Buried with Christ, risen to new life.